What is this sun? It's sunny and it's like not that cold. Wow. Well, it'll be perfect for this video then. Welcome guys, today we're getting out of the garage. We're actually gonna wash the car with my new Chemical Guys kit from Christmas. I'm pumped, the car needs washed. We're gonna have a couple dry days here. So let's get right to it. This is in 4K, turn up your video quality and enjoy this episode of Tungsten 4.0. I'm gonna be showing you everything in detail, so let's get started. Here she is before she's washed. Now you can't tell it's dirty, you know, it just sort of hides dirt very well, but on the sides of the back, it's really bad. So we're gonna get a fresh start here and try a foam cannon wash for the first time on this car. As far as I know, it's never had a foam cannon wash. I'm also gonna be using the, the wheel cleaner, the wheel and tire cleaner that it came with, and maybe some of the other products as well. I am not sponsored, I just want to try this out and see how it goes. First let's sweep this out, get a fresh start with my undersized broom. Way too small for me. So before we get started here, check out my video of the coilover install, where I tried to center the rear wheels with the white line adjustable pan hard bar. Now, it's a great product. Absolutely everything about it is fine, but the bolt on the car from Ford is completely stuck in the bushing. So I have to cut it out. I ordered the right bolt to replace it, but it's still in shipping, so I can't pick it up yet. It's gonna be a while, so for now, I've been driving with the wheels off center. And you can definitely tell it's not, the geometry's not right on the suspension, but the wheels are still wearing evenly, so not a huge concern. Just really want to get that bad boy on the car. Okay, bear with me for a minute. This is what I've been using to wash the car for over a year. It's just a simple microfiber thing you can pick up at any department store, and it is shot. So now I'm super excited to have a similar item, but it's a new one, fits over your hand. It's also chemical, guys. I got the complete kit here. So you can see the bucket where it allows dirt to settle in the sifter. Got the foam cannon, a double bucket method, and a few other cleaners. So I think it's time now. I've stalled enough, let's get started. And the back always gets the most dirty, so... Now we're gonna hook this up. Just like that. You've got yourself a nice foam can in here. You gonna set this to A to start and then adjust it from there. I 
think I want D. That's a lot firmer there. Okay, well that's about the fastest I've ever washed a car before. I totally covered the car and I've got soap left, so I don't know if for next time I can use less. definitely want to let it soak some and really let it melt off the dirt so you're not scratching it off. guys it's completely rinsed down now and I don't really have something to dry it with other than a little towel they gave me so I'm gonna try that as well as just letting it air dry a bit it seems super soft almost like it's been waxed and uh, so that's good I'm happy about that I'm gonna use the, the wheel cleaner next and then when it's all clean I'll show you a few clips the battery's dying it's getting freaking cold outside. Well, I have to say that is squeaky, squeaky clean, guys. Super happy with that wash and it is it's like I waxed it. It literally feels like I waxed it. So I'm happy with these products. They work great. It looks great. Let's take a walk around. Thank you guys again for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Share with me how you clean your Mustang. And I didn't get the wheel clips for you, I apologize, but this camera is dead. So I didn't have a full charge before I started. Again, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. See if you like them and then go from there. So I'll see you soon.